Bombardier just made every other private jet look slow. Seriously, they built a business jet that flew faster than the speed of sound in testing, and now it's about to change private travel forever. This isn't just about getting from A to B a little bit quicker. It's about fundamentally shrinking the globe for the people who can afford it. What they've packed inside this thing is just as crazy as its speed. So today, we're diving deep into the Bombardier Global 8000. This isn't just another luxury jet review. We're gonna pull apart every single detail, from the two massive engines that push it past 700 miles per hour to the four-room apartment you get to live in at 51,000 feet. We'll cover the technology that makes it the smoothest ride in the sky, and of course, we'll talk about the mind-boggling price tag of $81 million. By the end of this, you'll know exactly why this jet is the new king of the skies. Let's get straight into the main event. The reason this jet is making headlines everywhere, its speed and performance. This is where the Global 8000 doesn't just compete, it completely dominates. The headline number that everyone talks about is its top operational speed, Mach 0.94. Let's translate that into something we can all understand. That's 721 miles per hour or about 1160 kilometers per hour. This makes it the fastest purpose-built business jet in the world. Forget about being on time. In this jet, you can actually start to bend time to your will. But here's where it gets even crazier. During its development and testing phase, Bombardier pushed this machine to its absolute limits. In May of 2021, a global 7500 test vehicle, which is the platform the 8000 is built on, repeatedly broke the sound barrier, achieving speeds of Mach 1.015, he did this during a test flight accompanied by a NASA FA-18 fighter jet. Now, to be perfectly clear, its certified top speed for passengers is Mach 0.94. You won't be going supersonic with your friends on board. But the fact that the airframe and engines handled supersonic flight without any issues tells you just how unbelievably well-engineered this aircraft is. It has the power. It has the stability. It's just built differently. So what gives it this incredible power? The magic happens in the two engines mounted on the rear of the fuselage. These are General Electric Passport engines, and they are absolute marvels of modern engineering. Each one of these engines produces a staggering 18,920 pounds of thrust. They are specifically designed for long-range, high-speed business jets. They are not only powerful, but also incredibly efficient, which is crucial when we start talking about range. They're also designed to be quieter and have lower emissions than previous generation engines, which is becoming increasingly important in the aviation world. Now, let's talk about range, because speed is useless if you have to stop for gas all the time. The Global 8000 lives up to its name with a phenomenal range of 8,000 nautical miles. That's 9,206 miles or 14,816 kilometers. This number is so massive, it's almost hard to comprehend. It means you can fly non-stop between city pairs that were previously impossible. We're talking about flying from Dubai directly to Houston, from Singapore to Los Angeles, from London to Perth, Australia. It connects virtually any two cities on the planet with a single flight. This is the ultimate time machine for a global CEO, a diplomat, or a celebrity who needs to be on opposite sides of the world in the shortest time possible. But performance isn't just about speed and range. It's also about where you can go. Big jets often need very long runways, limiting them to major international airports. The Global 8000, however, boasts impressive short field performance for its size. It can take off in just 5,760 feet and land in as little as 2,237 feet under ideal conditions. This opens up a world of smaller, more convenient airports, allowing you to get closer to your final destination and avoid the chaos of massive airport hubs. Finally, let's talk about how high it flies. The Global 8000 has a service ceiling of 51,000 feet. Flying this high puts you way above most commercial air traffic and, more importantly, above most turbulent weather systems. This results in a significantly smoother, more comfortable flight. It's like cruising on a perfectly calm sea while everyone else is battling the waves down below. When you combine this record-breaking speed, planet-spanning range, and an incredibly smooth ride, you get the undisputed performance champion of private aviation. Now, as incredible as the performance is, what's on the inside of the Global 8000 is arguably just as impressive. Stepping into this jet isn't like boarding a plane. 
It's like stepping into a multi-million dollar penthouse apartment that just happens to fly at 94% the speed of sound. The cabin is where owners will spend all their time, and Bombardier has poured an insane amount of effort into making it the most comfortable, quiet, and customizable space in the sky. First, let's talk numbers. The cabin itself is huge. We're looking at a total length of 54.4 feet, or about 16.6 meters. The width is a generous 8 feet, and the cabin height is 6 feet 2 inches, so most people can stand up and walk around comfortably without crouching. This entire space is divided into four distinct, fully customizable living zones, plus a dedicated crew rest area and a massive galley. Let's walk through it. When you enter the aircraft, you first come into the club suite. This is designed as a comfortable area for work or relaxation. It features four of Bombardier's patented nuage seats. These aren't just airplane seats. They're more like revolutionary pieces of furniture. They have a deep recline feature, a tilting headrest for perfect neck support, and a unique floating base that allows you to move smoothly. It's the first new seat architecture in business aviation in 30 years, and it's designed for perfect comfort on a 16-hour flight. Each pair of seats has a side table that can be pulled out, perfect for a laptop or a drink. Moving back, you enter the conference suite. This is the heart of the jet for business or family dining. It's configured with a large table that seats six people. This is where you can hold a board meeting at 45,000 feet, with high-speed K-band Wi-Fi keeping you connected as if you were in your office. The internet is fast enough to stream 4K video or host video conferences without a problem. When the work is done, this area transforms into an elegant dining room where a full course meal can be served. The level of detail here is incredible, from the polished wood of the table to the custom lighting that can be set to any mood. Next is the entertainment suite. This is your private movie theater in the sky. It's dominated by a large 4K TV mounted on the wall and a comfortable L-shaped divan where you can stretch out and relax. Bombardier has worked to create an immersive audio experience, so watching a movie here feels just like being in a high-end home theater. This space is all about unwinding. After a long day of meetings, you can just sink into the sofa and watch your favorite movie as you cross the Atlantic. Finally, at the very back of the plane is the principal suite. This is your private sanctuary. It's a completely separate room that offers total privacy. Inside, you'll find a full-size bed, not a convertible sofa, but a proper, comfortable bed. There are large windows right next to it so you can wake up to the sunrise over the clouds. This room is also connected to an ensuite lavatory, which includes a wardrobe for your clothes and even the option for a full stand-up shower. Imagine taking a hot shower and then getting into bed while flying from New York to Tokyo. That's the level of luxury we're talking about. Of course, to support this lifestyle, you need a proper kitchen. The galley in the Global 8000 is massive and fully equipped. It's not just for reheating pre-packaged meals. It has steam and convection ovens, a microwave, a sink with hot and cold water, and extensive chilled storage. A private chef or flight attendant can prepare complex, multi-course gourmet meals from scratch right here. The entire cabin environment is also designed for wellness. The Bombardier Pure Air System features an advanced HEPA filter that captures up to 99.9% .9 of allergens, bacteria, and viruses. It also provides the cabin with 100% fresh air, never recirculated. And the entire cabin's air can be replaced in as little as 90 seconds. The cabin pressure is also kept remarkably low. At a cruising altitude of 41,000 feet, the cabin feels like you're at just 2,900 feet of altitude. This is lower than most cities. The result is that you arrive at your destination feeling refreshed and far less fatigued, which is a huge advantage. The 22 massive windows flood the cabin with natural light, further enhancing the sense of space and well-being. This isn't just a means of transport, it's a carefully crafted environment designed to be your home and office in the sky. While passengers enjoy the luxurious cabin, the pilots up front have their own state-of-the-art playground. The cockpit of the Global 8000 is known as the Bombardier Vision Flight Deck, and it's one of the most advanced in all of aviation. It's designed to reduce pilot workload, increase situational awareness, and make flying safer and more efficient. The centerpiece of the flight deck is the Collins Aerospace Proline Fusion Avionics Suite. Instead of a mess of dials and gauges, you have four massive crystal clear 19-inch displays. These screens can be configured to show anything the pilots need, from flight paths and weather maps to engine data and airport diagrams. It's a clean, futuristic layout that puts all critical information right at their fingertips. One of the key technologies here is fly-by-wire. In simple terms, this means the pilot's controls are not physically connected to the flight surfaces, like the wings and tail. 
Instead, the pilot's inputs go to a computer, which then sends electronic signals to actuators that move the surfaces. This has huge benefits. It allows the computer to make tiny, constant adjustments, which results in a much smoother flight for passengers, especially in turbulence. It also prevents the pilot from making any control inputs that would put the aircraft outside of its safe operating limits. It's like having a super smart co-pilot constantly working in the background to ensure safety and comfort. Perhaps the coolest piece of tech is the Combined Vision System, or CVS. This is a first in the industry. It takes two different technologies and merges them into one display for the pilot on the heads-up display, or HUD. The HUD is a transparent screen that the pilot can look through while still seeing key flight information projected onto it. The first technology is Enhanced Vision, or EVS, which uses an infrared camera on the nose of the plane to see through fog, rain, and darkness. The second is Synthetic Vision, or SVS, which uses a detailed GPS database to create a 3D digital image of the terrain, obstacles, and runways around the aircraft. By combining these, the pilot did a complete picture of the outside world, even in zero visibility conditions. It makes landing at night or in bad weather significantly safer. The Global 8000 cockpit is designed for a two-pilot crew, and there's also a dedicated crew rest area, which is essential for the ultra-long-range flights this jet is capable of. It ensures the flight crew can stay alert and well-rested throughout a 17-hour journey. Everything in this cockpit is about harnessing technology to make flying this incredible machine as safe, simple, and efficient as possible. Now let's talk about the price. Owning the pinnacle of aviation technology does not come cheap. The list price for a brand new Bombardier Global 8000 is approximately $81 million US. That's before you add any custom options or unique interior designs, which can easily push the price even higher. For that $81 million, you are getting the fastest, longest range, and one-of-a-kind flying experience on the planet. But the purchase price is just the beginning of the story. The cost of owning and operating a jet like this is astronomical. You have to factor in fuel, which can run into thousands of dollars per hour. Then there's maintenance, insurance, crew salaries, hangridge fees at airports, and navigation chart subscriptions. All in, the fixed annual costs can be well over a million dollars, and the variable hourly costs are significant. It's a level of expenditure reserved for the world's wealthiest individuals, largest corporations, and governments. This jet isn't just a purchase, it's a significant ongoing financial commitment. So who is buying this jet? The target market is a very exclusive club, we're talking Forbes list billionaires, CEOs of Fortune 500 companies who need to travel globally for business, and heads of state who require a secure and reliable form of transport. For them, the time saved by flying faster and further than anyone else can genuinely be worth the price tag. The ability to leave New York after a day of meetings and arrive in Dubai ready for another day without the hassle of commercial travel is an invaluable strategic advantage. The Bombardier Global 8000 is more than just a new private jet. It's a statement. It represents the absolute peak of what is currently possible in private aviation. It takes the crown as the world's fastest and longest range business jet, capable of connecting almost any two points on the globe non-stop. Inside, it offers a four-zone cabin that feels more like a luxury apartment than an aircraft, packed with technology designed for ultimate comfort and productivity. From the sound-breaking cuss flights to the 51,000-foot cruising altitude, everything about this machine is designed to push the boundaries. At 81 million, it's a tool for those whose time is the most valuable commodity in the world. It's not just about luxury, it's about buying back time, and you can't put a price on that. Watch our video on the Gulfstream C700 to see how it compares.